あ<笑>
and there's his eyes and could give him a nose I'm gonna give him a nose that's like a triangle and you can make your own nose too you guys know how to draw people okay and if you don't I can show you just copy mine if you don't know how to draw it yourself okay so I want my hair my hair goes like this so I'm gonna give him hair like me maybe you draw your hair like you okay if you need to you can go look in the mirror you could always pause it remember that okay so this is my first character it's a little boy and he's behind door number one okay so door number one is my character okay then we got to make another door so this maybe this doesn't work or maybe I'm going to do like this. So I'm going to cut this into a rectangle. So you got to look. How am I going to make a card that's going to work? Okay. So either I could just cut it and make a little door. Right. So I could do that. So if I do that. So I want you thinking, how do I make my doors? Okay. That's a door. Okay, so now um, I'm going to think of the setting. So what's what's the setting? Let's see. So the setting's going to be at the beach. So I'm going to do the sand. I'm going to do a tree. So I do the trunk. I do the leaves. Curve, zigzag, zigzag, curve, zigzag, zigzag, curve, zigzag. I can put as many leaves as I want. It's my tree. And then put coconuts and put lines on the tree. Okay, if that was really fast, you can always pause it and do it yourself, okay? So if I ever go fast, remember you're on the internet, so you can pause it. Okay, but also just remember how I did it. Line for the tree. Did lines, curved lines with zigzags. Zigzags. Okay, put my coconuts. And I put my lines on the tree, and this is my beach. Okay, and then I'm going to make another circle and a rectangle for my key. So my key will open this one and I can see the setting, okay? So now I have a character and a setting. Okay, now here's another door. I could use this as another door. And what he's gonna do at the beach is he's going to what are we going to have him do at the beach? He's going to play with a ball. So I'm going to draw a circle for a ball. And I'm going to draw like a half circle, like a moon. Or like a, like a happy face. And a sad face. Then I'm going to do a curve line. And a curve line. And then I'm going to write the word B. A L L ball. Okay, so he can play with the ball at the beach. So my character, my little boy, can go to the beach and play with the ball. Okay? So I'm going to draw a place for my key because this is one of my details. So I have a place for my key, so my magic key can open it. Oh, I found a ball. So I can actually, let's see, let's make a story now. So now we have all the details of a story and all the special doors, and we have the key. Now we can play. So here's what we're going to play. So I'm going to turn, I'm going to have all my doors with their doors closed. I'm going to mix them up. Okay, and I'm going to pick this one first. 
So I could even stand up my doors. I'm gonna pick this one first and I say, ch -ch -ch -ch, open it. Oh, the story begins with a little boy. Okay. Then I'm gonna take another, another door, open it up. Ch -ch -ch -ch. And oh, he had a ball with him and he wanted to go somewhere. Okay. I take my last door. Ch -ch -ch. And he ended up at the beach and he had a really good time. Okay, so very good. So now, depending on how you pick your doors with your magic key, you could tell your story. Okay, so we learned about key details. Okay, so key details today help us make really, really cool stories. And we get to cut stuff out and have fun making stuff from stuff that we find around our house. Look at that. Like, see, this is just for butter, and I found it in the garbage. My mom was done with it, and I got to use it. And look, I had a lot of fun with you guys. Okay, boys and girls. Well, thank you <laughs> for coming. And this is what we do. So we're going to have fun, and I'll have more lessons. And this is a little bit about what we're doing. And the best thing about all this is you could hit pause and rewind and do it again. You could even... Send it to a friend or have your parents do it with you. But there's lots of fun. Look, we can use any of this for more stuff, okay? So anytime you got really cool stuff, I just want you to get a little box or something and keep it all together. So maybe I'll take this box, instead of cutting it up, this is where I'll keep all of my stuff. Because we want to stay organized with our stuff so we don't lose it, so we don't make too big of a mess. And if we ever need stuff, we'll have a box of really cool stuff that we save. So I'm gonna make some of them a little bit neater. So like that. And now I have a lot of gold. Okay, I have a lot of gold. And I have my game that I already got to play. Okay? So thank you very much boys and girls and I'll see you on the next time we're in Mr. Joshua's classroom. Okay, bye bye.